it's useful to have an assistant and today I'm assisted by the lovely Dr. Wills. Yep. The large muscle in the centre of the screen, again, a two centimetre will be fine. Scratch now. Mm -hmm. There it is. So, brachioradialis, just palpate it between your fingers first to ensure you're in the right spot. And there it is in the centre of the screen. This is the muscle here in the centre of the screen. Scratch. There's the tip of the needle. I'm going to try and demonstrate the movement in the muscle now. And this is another, yet another advantage of ultrasound is that it's dynamic. So you can move the hand or the wrist and you can see the dynamic movement in the muscle and I can assure I'm in the right place. Again, if I wish to, I can use a guide to indicate where the centre of the probe is and run my needle down in line with the little mark on the probe. And that should appear in the centre line now. And you'll see the fluid running in. FDS sits on the other side of the ulna and inserts distally into the fingers. It's a long flexor tendon and if I move the fingers you should be able to see that movement in the muscle. I'm, notice I'm not moving the wrist, I'm just moving the fingers. And the shape on the left of the screen as you look at it is the ulna and FDS is sitting immediately alongside that. Looks like a little vessel. Hold still. Scratch now. Mm -hmm. Here he is. Yep. You can see the tissue being distended by the toxin as it works its way in. Mm 